Hey there, guys. Oh, you must have caught me. Uh, must have caught me watching Meetsy's channel over here. But uh, yeah, this is actually going to be a video I'm going to be doing today. So of course you guys are watching this. So welcome to another one of my videos. I'm Drudels Blitz, and in today's video we're going to be talking about something that I kind of thought was funny. So this video here was Meetsy's, 100% to Meetsy. This is actually his video we're looking at. And on this video, he has its world of dummies, where he talks about these two AMX CDCs, which you can see over here are just rubbing this WT up on the butt and in the front. So they're causing this WT to pretty much ruin the game. So it's three players out of the game, and uh, they're pretty much causing every single battle they play in to be losses. Now, I don't remember what the clan was, if I can see here, but you'll notice that it is renamed user underscore 10, and he's platooned with a guy in ace underscore X. It's a pram O with a it's a zero instead of the letter O, so this is 100% not Pramo Clan. I respect Pramo Clan. They're actually good players and really reasonable people there. This is a complete fake clan. So first of all, I thought, you know, these people are just major, major jerks. There's not much you can do about them, you know. I think Meetsy actually got them banned, which is great. Good on you, Meetsy. They said that they got banned, and you may be asking, well, how did I know that they got banned? Well, if we load up my World of Tanks, good, it didn't crash. For some reason, my Microsoft Edition likes to crash. But, you know, I was trying to make a video today, and I'll post the video tomorrow because I still got the recording out. But I was trying to make a video today. I was talking about vehicles that had been power crept in World of Tanks splits that used to be super overpowered. And I was playing in my IS-3 Defender. You know, I wasn't thinking much of the match here. I was playing the 59, T-54, and IS-3 Defender. You will see that video hopefully tomorrow. I'll probably retry and do it, though. Because, yeah, you don't want to see a replay where uh, where something like this happens. But we take a look at the matchup, and I need to get rid of that. But uh, what do we have here? We have Pramo with the zero, some trash, World of Tanks Blitz, and we have a trash player. Now, what was funny is I didn't really notice that off the bat. I don't really read my team lineups anymore. I was just like, eh, I'm just going to get a video out. We'll just, you know, read the lineup maybe a little bit, read the enemy lineup. I wasn't really worrying much about it. But immediately... I read these two comments in the chat, and I was like, okay, these CDCs are obviously platooning, so I opened up the thing, and I was like, that Pramo with the Zero Clan is very reminiscent of the clan that, uh, that means he was talking about in his video. And uh, after they started continuing the trash talk and be like that, I was like, yep, that is either the exact same players they say that it isn't the player. I talked to them, and they were like, oh, no, we're not the same player. We are avenging our band clanmates. Now, you don't really avenge your uh, mates. Now, I pretty much expected this to happen by this point. I was like, okay, yeah, they're probably going to troll me. So I was like, okay, so we're just going to be AFK here. And there you go. See, I saw you on Meetsy. So... These people, pretty much what they've been doing, and this is 100% toxic. I'm going to be sending this to Darth Antonius, which works for Wargaming. They're going to be banned probably again. They've already banned Ben once. So I'm going to take it a step further. Because we know that they're in the Pramo with the Zero Clan now, 100% on Pramo, don't go yelling at Pramo. They're good people over there. This is a fake Pramo clan. I'm going to contact Wargaming and see if they can literally get rid of the clan. Not ban all the players in it, because, you know, there might actually be some good players in it. Could be all just bull crap and lies. But um, I would love for Wargaming to get rid of the clan. Because obviously you've had two people go into the same clan now. Is that a coincidence? No. I bet you that the clan lead knows of something like this. Maybe the clan lead is up to something, letting these people do it. He's supplying them. I don't know. That's some sort of conspiracy theory. But all I do know is that you have two extremely toxic players. And if you've ever watched Klaus Kellerman on World of Tanks PC, he has talked about the same issue where you can get these really cheap premium tanks in Blitz where I don't think they really care. They're, they're buying uh, tanks in Blitz for, let's say, I don't know, they have money. They're just people that want to have fun, college kids or something. They've spent let's say 10 bucks for both these tanks, you can get a CDC for literally $5 on a really cheap day. So they've got the CDCs for $10 in total, and all they're doing with their CDCs is trolling people. You can get as many downvotes as you want in World of Tanks Blitz, and you can't get banned. But the funny thing is that I have a friend, Serpent in Void, who you guys probably remember, I did a video with on... I think it was, I don't remember, I played my 113 in it, I was talking about, I don't remember what it was on, but in that video, I platooned a serpent, and she was playing just a normal blitz battle, and then some random person started messaging her, because he didn't like the Void Clan, and 
just randomly started making up false accusations and got her chat banned for a month. And I'm going to con I've contacted Wargaming about that. I'm going to see if I can get that unbanned because that's extremely ridiculous. She contacted Wargaming and they literally said that they aren't going to fix her chat ban for a month. That's ridiculous. And yet you have people like these two CDCs here who are ruining the game and yet they get hundreds of downvotes. The one CDC player has 29 games. So he's just started, you know, he's just a a beginning of an asshole. But we also have the CDC. The other guy has 500 games. Now, when you think about it, 500 games is a lot of battles and they've got like 20% win rates. Now, that's amazing when you think about it because the average player has about a 30% win rate if you literally don't do anything and you're AFK every game. So not only are all those 500 games, they're literally trolling their teammates, but that's all they're doing. So they have no purpose in life other than to waste. And let's just pull out a calculator really quick. So let's say the average blitz game lasts, I don't know, three, three, three minutes. Sure. We'll just do three minutes and that's 500 games. So what? That's 1500 minutes. And we'll divide that by 60. So that person has wasted 25 hours of their life, a literal day of their life, trolling random people in blitz. Plus that other guy, which had another thousand. So this class hundreds of hours and also probably quite a bit of money. I'd say, you know, maybe, um, I can't say the craziest amount of money, but you know, we'll say maybe a hundred dollars this clan has spent just dropping money. I was messaging them too. I was like, what the heck are you guys doing? Well, obviously I know what they were doing. And here's, by the way, first tip is don't rage. When you see people like this and you see them just yelling in chat, don't rage, create a ticket, send it to Wargaming, they might not do anything, send it to me, send it to me too, because at least if Wargaming won't do anything with the chat ticket, like I said for my friend Serpent, literally can't get her chat un unbanned, which is the dumbest thing I've ever heard, this is sort of like the same thing where people get, and let me exit this battle just to see, people get, how many downvotes does the CDC have? Well, actually somehow, that's the guy that, uh, that only has 28 games. Let's look at the guy that has 501. So zero stars, 38, uh, not 38 praise. Somehow he got praises. Effective player. Yeah, that's kind of funny. But 80 complaints. Now, for 80 complaints and um, for the entire assessment history, he's had 517 complaints. That's 517 complaints more, or should I say maybe 500, okay? After a player, in my opinion, there should be some sort of automation thing where a player, and they've got a, a chat ban now, which means that they actually have gotten a ban, which is kind of funny on chat. But um, the funny thing is, is that these players have 500 downvotes and yet not one penalty on gameplay has been added to them. In my opinion, Wargaming, if you're listening to this video, it would be so, so simple if you just made the simplest system that literally after, let's say, 100 complaints, they come up into this little watch list. Now, not 100 complaints, maybe in, you know, I've got, how many complaints do I have? I My, my account is, I'd say, I don't know, five years old on this account. This isn't my oldest account, but this account has 50,000 games in it, and all of the downvotes I've had over that entire time is 67, which is usually me just yelling at people or something like that. I have 25,000 praises. So if you have, in my opinion, more than 100 complaints, because I've got literally 50,000 games and not 100, and I haven't gotten a, a complaint in the last year, if you have over 100 complaints, make a simple system that is immediately put that person under your radar. That Simple area, simple area, yes. It simply just literally puts them under your radar. Then you can look at their account. You can see what the, the downvotes are for, how many they've gotten. You can look at their past replays and ban them. Just get rid of them. It's very simple. You know, it's less than literally 50 games. You can get 100 downvotes from doing something like that. So in my opinion, that's something that should be taken into effect immediately fixing people like this. Klaus Kellerman makes videos in World of Tanks PC players that abuse the system of getting like free tier 5 premiums with the codes and then literally just hopping in platoons. People are doing this the same way in World of Tanks splits. And it's not only unfair to new players and people that just want to have a fun time, but it's also unfair to people like me, who I was literally recording a video and they ruined the entire video today. They literally caused me to not only stop doing the video, you know, normally I won't go on my way to just make a video of people like that because it's not worth it. They're just going to do it again. But first of all, they spent money, so I want to get rid of the money they spent because, you know, at least take away something they've had. And second of all, it kind of annoyed me that I was in the middle of making a video. I I've already seen them on Meetsy's channel, and uh, then they continue to annoy me. Yeah, I was like, you know what? No, I'm just gonna make a video. Screw it. They've already screwed mine, so I'll make a simple video, one attempt on it. So, yeah, 
people are annoying in Blitz, and it's kind of sad how bad the human race can be in a certain tense. America, yeah, we're not doing too well right now. Not only do we have all this COVID stuff with, um, I'm not going to get into politics, but yeah, people are saying literally that masks deplete your oxygen level, morons. You've got so much stuff going on, and it kind of relates to real life. It's just how toxic people are in game compared to real life. So kind of shows something. Those people obviously are... It shows something about them in real life, too. I would never, ever want to be friends with those kind of people. So, yeah, just just keep an eye out for people like that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I just want to make, a, first of all, a fair warning. If you see any Platoon of CDCs out there and you see that one of them is in the Pramo clan with the fake O, just know what you've got yourself into and make sure to re report them to Wargaming with the ticket. But other than that, I hope you're all doing well out there. Stay happy, stay healthy, and I'll see you in the next one.